Welcome back to Don's Life. Welcome to the channel. Thanks for joining today. It looks like spring has come to Saskatoon here in Canada. The snow is just about melted. I hope that's the last of it. So for today's mod, we are going to do something sporty, a sporty little upgrade to the GMC Sierra AT4. Let's go. So today's upgrade will require a little bit of spring cleaning. It is time to clean these mats off a little bit and then put the carpet inserts in. If you haven't seen these mats before, I'll move this back a little bit here. We're doing this all one-handed. Try not to dump the dirt. The struggle is real. But these mats have carpet inserts. So I'm just gonna clean this up really quick. And if you look, I had one of those snaps break off. In the early years of ownership, but it's okay, the carpet that goes there stays put. So let's clean this up really quick. We might as well do the passenger one. I'll do the back one a different day, but we're gonna clean these front ones here and then proceed with the sporty upgrade that goes in this truck. We'll just let those dry out and now we'll unbox our sporty little upgrade brought to you by 404parts.com. That's right, we have a genuine GM part and they are a sport pedal package. That's gonna make the truck more sporty. So let's open it up and see what we got. We got the accelerator and we got the brake. Pretty sure they go that way. Are you sure? Absolutely sure. And then we got all this extra stuffing just in case. One can never be too well prepared. Let's go. These look nice. This is a no drill installation. Ooh, look how nice that is. Let's open this one. All right. So these are supposed to enhance pedal feel. They're made of stainless steel. We got the raised rubber traction pads here and they're designed to fit over the existing pedals. So no drilling required. So I think we should throw the mats back in and then install these. And here's that part number again. I'll leave a link in the video description below, so don't worry, but this is it here. Well, I think these are dry enough. It's always one that fights you. And that one doesn't snap, but see, it's okay. No, I've never claimed to be smart, but this does not look like it fits over the existing pedal. It looks like you had to peel this one off. So that's exactly what we're going to do. That's pretty easy. Looks the same. This actually looks easier to put on. So we'll start at this corner and lay it around so we have this little tab to grip onto. And it's not that easy. It's harder than it looks. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe to go on this side. I don't really know. This is gonna be harder than I thought. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna use a tiny, tiny bit of this synthetic grease, just uh, like a silicone grease. I use it for my sea suckers that hold the cargo box on my C8. I don't know if this will actually help, but we're gonna try it. Okay, round two, fight. I'm gonna go this way again. Well, it makes it slipperier for me.
Well, we got the top on and this side on. The bottom is just not on. I'm gonna grab my pick tool. Maybe this will help, maybe it won't. But what I'm doing is I'm just gonna use this to drag the bottom edge like that, if I can, without knocking it off. The hardest part is just getting the edge. Oh, we gotta start it, almost. There we go. Now I should be able to slide this along, maybe. I'm just gonna muscle it. If you push in and roll the bottom out, kinda works. There, we got it. That was not easy, but it is on there good. And that's the difference, gross. Now this one. Oh good, I saved the easy one for last. This does not come off, this goes on top. Which is the top, which is the bottom. All right, see, it goes like that. Good thing this doesn't have a carburetor, otherwise we'd be probably flooding it. I'm gonna do this again. This is optional, but it is not the easiest thing to glide over these edges. It's funny, after looking at this pedal, it's so ridiculous. This is going to be much nicer. Oh, it's so close. There we go. I don't know what I do without this pick tool. Oh, we're right at the bottom now. That's all good up there. It's this bottom piece. Final stretch. Literally. We got it. It is on. Well, there we go. We got some sporty pedals. Let's see how they feel. Hard to say, but we do know that the accelerator pedal is larger and they do feel grippy. But the other one was rubber over here already. The other one here was just plastic. So I'd say the accelerator pedal for sure is definitely an improvement in feel and grippiness. I like the upgrade. Now it is a super sport, maybe. Well, there we go. I think we nailed it. I love these sport pedals. Thanks again to 404parts.com for sending them over. I guess I don't need this anymore, but definitely head over to 404parts.com's website where they have genuine GMC parts and accessories, as well as a few things that maybe you're not gonna find anywhere else. Definitely check them out. Use the promo code DAWN404 to save yourself some money. But if you like today's video, hit that like button. Please consider subscribing. We'll talk to you next time.